this is not where I had planned on filming this intro, but my camera is apparently dead, even though I thought I charged it last night. So it's sitting at my desk in the kitchen. Anyways, hey y'all, and welcome back to my little corner of the internet. My name is Alil, and welcome to Vlogmas Day 14. They on, I need light from you. I know the lighting is not the greatest, which is why I'm using the screen, computer screen for light, but we're just gonna, we're just gonna roll with it. Let's talk about yesterday's video. I thought that we were gonna be doing more, and we did so I should have taken more clips uh, in the morning while I was making breakfast, and more at the ice skating rink. I'm sorry, I did not. Uh, but it was super fun. I had so much fun at the ice skating rink. And I said I was gonna be sore. I am sore in all of the right places. Like the inside of the thigh, you know, the thick thighs, under the arms, my abs, you know, from all the balance, like, sore in the right places. I should, I should ice skate more often. That was, that was a fun workout and I didn't know I was working out until I was done. Well, I did know, but. I didn't feel it until today. I still got up and went to the gym this morning and got today's video up. Now I need to take a shower and get ready for the day because we have a lot to do today. Mainly grocery shopping and meal prepping. So you will get another grocery haul in this video and um, we need to do a little bit of meal prepping. I don't think we need to do a whole ton. I tried to plan meals this week that didn't take a lot of prep because, because I don't have a ton of time this week. That's the plan today. I'm gonna stop rambling and I'm gonna go get ready for the day so we can get this day rolling. We're having leftover pizza and fettuccine for lunch. Mm. That just came out of the toaster oven so it's really hot. But really good fresh actually. It's like 20 minutes away so when it got here last night it was already like, you know, kind of cold a little bit not like super toasty and fresh. It's really Really good Contacts are in now. I can see. It's Malik Pizza Time. I'm. Hello. You're wearing a towel. It's fine. It's fine. The people like it. Give the people what they want. This is what I'm wearing to the grocery store. It is already 3 p.m. and I have not gone to the grocery store, which is wild because I usually go like first thing in the morning. That's okay. Here we go, get back, clean the kitchen, um, and prep for dinner because, like I said, I'm not, I'm not making anything this week that needs a ton of prep. But we will do a grocery haul when I get back. Ooh, these are very heavy. Hold on. I'm trying to get a thumbnail and I don't think that's working. Okay. We'll just do it with two of the bags. I know the lighting's probably not great because it's 4.30 and dark outside. I always see YouTubers doing like grocery hauls with like one or two bags and I'm like, what are you eating? How do you eat for the week? There's two of us in this house and I come home with like four bags every week. They probably just have the money to eat out all the time. Not a luxury I have. All right, let's get into this. It is two weeks before Christmas, so of course we had to get some vegan eggnog because honestly, if you don't like eggnog, try a vegan eggnog. I don't know why, but it's better. And I, I know that like, obviously I'm gonna promote vegan stuff, but it's just objectively tastes better. So try it. If you get offered an eggnog that is non-dairy and egg-free, it's just, it actually tastes good. It tastes like a sweet, it tastes like a sweet spiced drink. But yeah, this will be good through January. So I went ahead and grabbed it. And now I can make people eggnog drinks. I got a big thing of tofu. We are making so many tofu dishes this week. I'm making soba soup that's gonna have tofu. I'm making some, a few different rice bowls and that of course will have tofu in it. We got some more bread. I 
got a couple bags of soy nuggets. I'm going to use one bag or at least part of a bag tonight because I'm making aki odon for dinner. I will leave a link to the recipe video down below. I did upload that recipe on here as one of like a short. So I will link that down below and in a card. So, so good. I think in that video I used so soy curls, but I can't find soy curls at Whole Foods. I have to go to like a special store for it. So I just grabbed this. Just a little more unhealthy, but delicious. Honestly, this best vegan chicken on the market. Best plant-based chicken that exists. The texture, the taste, it's incredible. Just egg for some of those rice bowls. So we're doing a lot of Japanese rice bowls this week and they're always just like eggs and rice and then maybe a protein. That's it. Um, more conditioner and I actually grabbed a detangling spray because I've been having a lot of issues with tangled hair. If you, I washed my hair on Friday. By Saturday, back here, like this area, was a rat's nest. It was matted. It was already starting to mat. I don't know what to do at this point. I like tried to do a hair mask and maybe I need to do them more often. Maybe I need to do a different hair mask. I don't know. But if you have curly hair, super wavy, curly, damaged, thick, long hair, and you know how to take care of it where it doesn't get tangled and you still get your curls instead of just brushing out your curls, let me know. I need help. Desperately need help. They were totally out of the makeup remover I usually use, so I grabbed this one. It's supposed to be similar. I hope it works. Bag number two. I picked up two different boxes of mushrooms. This one is probably gonna go in the fried rice, and then this one is probably gonna go in the soba soup. I got a bunch of baby bok choy, and I know, whoa, plastic, I don't ever use that. Um, this is the only plastic bag I got. I totally forgot to grab my bags, that's why I got these paper bags, because I was running late to the store today. Bananas, what? Oh yeah, there's, look, I got two things of bananas. So bananas, some that are gonna be ripe soonish and then some that are gonna take a bit longer. Got a bag of apples. I've been really loving cooked apple breakfasts. It's so like apple crisp, stuffed apples, just chopped up apples in or on top of oatmeal. I've been really liking that as like winter breakfast. I also grabbed some ginger, some green onions. I got a frozen bag of mushrooms and a bag of broccoli. I keep frozen mushrooms and frozen vegetables on hand to like make quick, easy like stir fries and stuff over the weekends. This weekend we ate out a lot. I don't think I cooked at home except for breakfast. Yeah, we get back. We're getting back on track during the week. I don't think I really overate at all though, so that's good. I had, I ate out and I ate bad stuff, but I didn't overeat. I only ate like half of my food at Beer Plant. Shredded carrots. I usually don't get so many like already cut bagged things, but it's vlogmas and I need all the help I can get. So since it's a couple weeks after Thanksgiving, all their cranberries are on sale. I think I got this for a dollar and I want to make some cranberry orange muffins because that sounds delicious. Avocados, baking powder and salt. So this is the kind of flour I use when I do use all-purpose flour and you know it's Christmas cookie season so I needed to stock up on some flour. This is locally milled artisan strains of flour and it's so good. I really really like their whole wheat flour because it's a finer grind than most whole wheat flour you get and it's just amazing but this is just their regular all-purpose flour. I forgot to say ignore the mess behind me. I'm gonna do the dishes after I put all of this away. And last bag, tortillas for like breakfast tacos on the weekend and just to keep tortillas on hand because my partner really likes to just eat tortillas as a snack. White beans, cocoa powder, I use the rest of it in those brownies so I need to get some more cocoa powder. Coconut sugar, I use this in place of like sugar for the most part. I love this teriyaki sauce. It's such simple ingredients and there's no oil, so I love to have this around to just pop on rice bowls and stir fries and that kind of stuff. I grabbed some more no chicken stock, because I'm almost out. Can of chickpeas. 
This is a refill on foaming hand soap because we use foaming hand soap in our second bathroom and we're out. And then we usually, y'all know, and then y'all know we usually get coffee at the farmer's market except the stand that we get the coffee from is not at the Saturday market, which is what we've been going to lately. And we don't have plans to like go to the Sunday market anytime soon. And we only have like a cup of whole beans left of the coffee we usually get. And I saw this and it was on sale and I decided to try it. It is the Whole Foods brand winter coffee blend. It's a limited edition. It's a big bag that'll last us like all month, probably. It can probably last us a while. I'd say like at least until January, at the very least. So yeah, I'm excited to try this coffee. All right, now I get to put all of this away and then clean my kitchen. I was hoping to have time to take a nap today, but I don't think that's gonna happen. So much stuff. I am really excited to try this though. My hair is so bad, so bad. Okay, I'm sorry. I know you can hear the dishwasher in the background. I was about to do all the dishes and then realized the dishwasher never got ran this morning so it was full. So, uh, I know I could do the dishes by hand but I don't want to. I should. I will, I guess. Let's do some dishes. dinner and then we curled up on the cuddle puddle which is still on the floor and I fell asleep so it is, it is bedtime I hope you enjoyed today's video don't forget to follow me on Instagram, Twitter and TikTok, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the bell so you don't miss <coughs> hit the subscribe button and ring that bell so you don't miss a video from me and I will see you guys tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 15. Bye, y'all.